I would like to show you how to calculate for the number of blocks needed for a partition wall. So there are basically two parameters that we have to get. One is the area of the partition wall. The second parameter that we'll get is the area of the block. Well, in Nigeria, typically we use concrete hollow blocks. That's what we usually use for our, our walls, interior walls, our exterior walls. For this video, I'm going to use this partition wall for this illustration. So I'm going to have my friend Ebube is going to uh, take the measurements with me. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get the height of the partition and the length of the partition. So let's get the height first. So to get the height, I'm going to place our tape 2.94 meters. We have 2.7 meters, 225 millimeters, 450 millimeters. So we're going to calculate the total number of blocks. Now we have the the height and length of the wall, the same for the blocks. So for the for the wall, we have 2.94 meters height and we have 2.7 meters length. And for the block, we have 0 0.225 meters height and we have 0 0.45 meters length. And with this information, we're going to calculate for the area of the wall and the block. Now for the area of the wall, typically to get the area, we do height times the length. So our height is 2.94 meters times our length, which is 2.7 meters. And we have 7.938 square meters. And for the area of the block, uh, it's typically going to be the same thing. That's the height times the length. Our height is 0 0.225 meters times the length, which is 0 0.45 meters. And we have 0 0.10125 square meters. Now, to get the total number of blocks, we're going to do area of the wall divide by the area of the block. Now, the area of the wall we got is 7.938 square meters divided by 0.10125 square meters. And with that, we're going to get 78.4 blocks. Now, we're going to round this up to 80 blocks because ideally, we don't have anything like 78.4 we always have to anticipate for more blocks on site while doing the partition wall. Okay guys, if this video was helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this. If you have other ideas on how to calculate for the number of blocks in the wall, you can share in the comments. Thank you.